Oh, it's No Face Moon Ring Warnings and Watches for April the 10th to April the 15th, 2013 for Earth and uh, space weather activities and storms. Uh, first off, we got 20% chance of a polar geomagnetic storm for today and tomorrow when a solar wind stream will hit Earth today or tomorrow. So be prepared. So warnings and watches still in effect for storms will increase in the next seven days. From the energy that's going to hit the earth, it depends on how severe the storm is. So, um, earthquakes and volcano activities and even some blackouts. Let's move down. Um, I got breaking news. Um, the sun actually picked up speed. I'm not quite sure how that is possible. Probably from the central galactic plane. That's the reason it picked up speed. Just like Mercury, uh, Venus, and Mars. But now the sun, all of a sudden, picked up speed. I mean... It takes days for uh, sunspots to move this fast across the sun. All right, 1711, like I said, could produce an X-class solar flare. It's like it's starting to die, but it still could produce a whammy of a punch. Um, 1714 could produce an M to X-class solar flare, a small one, though. Um, like I told you, 1718 yesterday uh, could produce X-class as it's growing. And as you can see here in the picture, this could be a film and eruption. And trust me, it would be bigger than an M class. It would be an X class solar flare. Same with 1719. And it's not done. It's going to pick up speed and grow a little bit bigger. All right. We got another sunspot down here, as you can see. But they did not label it. We got a lot of sunspots. One up here that they didn't label either. So something's going on where they're not labeling sunspots. As we scroll, they uh, got news on Comet Isons. And like I was talking about yesterday. We got four particles circle as comet isons when we know comet ison is one thing. I'm not quite sure why they would circle more than one thing. So we're going to do a video on that. We're going to do some deep research. So stay tuned for next week. We're going to do it. Uh, we got a small coronal hole down here at the south end of the sun that will have small impacts of solar winds around the 14th or 15th. All right, let's move on. When we go to the images, you see stereo B, these are the next sunspots coming. Um, in the southern limb, we're going to see one, two, three sunspots popping up in the next two to three days. We're going to see a major coronal hole around Saturday, Sunday. It's going to produce solar winds in the north and in the south, two coronal holes. And they should arrive around, i say, the 17th, 18th of April. Stereo A. Stereo A is picking up with sunspots. So next week, sometimes we're going to see a lot, a lot of solar activity. As we move on, I'm seeing something strange here. It looks like a blast, um, but really it looks like they faded out something here. So check that out. Um, comment, what do you think? Um, we can see that uh, solar beam hitting the sun right there. You can see Mars in the background and Venus aligned perfectly. All right. So warnings and watches for gravitational pull on the Earth. Um as we move on, we can see Mercury is about to make its final compilation. It only took it 43 days to make a full circle around the sun. Um, on April the 13th, it took it 42 days, 42, 43 days, give it take a day or two. But it should take uh, Mercury 88 days. So I got warnings and watches for today. Same with Venus. It skipped a whole bunch of sections. It's picking up speed and it's lined up perfect with Mars as you can see right here alright and um, this is accurate folks alright this is real accurate um, Earth is over here around 25 and I put those warnings and watches all year um, around the end of April I'm at the end of March um, beginning of April we're gonna start seeing a lot of things picked up since the Earth is 40 percent in the elliptic plane and it's pulling out of Earth we might be out of control soon too so we're gonna see a lot of storms we're gonna see crazy storms for the rest of the year, all the way up till November, December, maybe even January. We're going to see crazy earthquakes, crazy volcano activity. We're going to see a lot of stuff that we should not see normal in any year in history. We're going to see something that's amazing too in November, Comet Isons. So I want everyone out, out there, be prepared for today on Wednesday, then be prepared for Friday. All right, folks, since Mercury and Venus is out of control, and I'm going to say be prepared um, for Sunday, too. Um, since the sun is actually picking up speed, it's kind of crazy and it's unique. Um, I, I have never seen that before, folks. All right. So uh, keep a watch out for that. Um, and my bad. Actually, Mars is losing control. 
So we're gonna do a whole video right now on this. Um, this this is unique. Let's do the cities and states for each day. All right, here's the warnings for Wednesday, today the tenth. Let's get into the countries and the cities and the meanings for Mercury being out of orbit. Uh, the cities would be London, San Francisco, Versailles, and Melbourne. The countries would be the United States, Wales, and Belgium. And also these countries and cities. Uh, Paris, Boston, Heidelberg, and Strasbourg. Countries, Turkey, Greece, Crete, and West Indies. Mercury tends to rule communication, messages, intellect, and wit. So usually you have difficulty with communication and just watch how you communicate on all levels, whether it's through technology, cellular devices, uh, person to person, co-workers, etc. Alright, these are the warnings for Friday. The 12th. So since we see Venus is out of control, these are the cities and these are the countries. So we're going to do countries first for Friday. Ireland, Switzerland, Cyprus, and Greece. Also Burma, China, Tibet, Argentina, and Japan. And these are the cities? The cities are Vienna, Copenhagen, Charleston, and Lisbon, as well as... Dublin, Lucerne, Leipzig, and St. Louis. And Venus stands for love and relationships. So we might see a lot of countries, major events around love and relationships between these countries and cities. All right, now these are warnings and watches for Mars being out of control. Leo, the war planet for Sunday. All right, folks, let's get into it. These are the cities and countries for Sunday. Excuse me there, I just messed up. Uh, since the sun is out of control, and we can see the sunspots, I apologize, folks. Um, like I said, I've been through a lot of stuff this week through surgery. But since Sunday represents the sun, these are the cities and the countries. Let's go. The cities are Rome, Prague, Damascus, and Hollywood. The countries are France, Italy, and Romania. All right, now we're going to get into Tuesday since Tuesday for next week. Um, since... Mars is out of control, and uh, it's a, the war planet. I mean, war in action. Here's the cities and the countries, warnings for major storms, all that stuff for next Tuesday. The cities are Florence, Naples, Verona, and Marseille. The countries would be England, Germany, and Poland. And you can see all this activity right here, folks. All right. Look at how fast these planets are moving. We're going to do a more in-depth video next week because I just noticed it today. Um, so I want people out there be prepared. Have bug out kids in their home and their place of business for Wednesday, for Friday, for Sunday, and next Tuesday. Now I got warnings and watches. Look at all. This is the FOF2 map. Look at all that pressure. This is amazing high dense pressure um, that's coming, pushing down on these plates. So warnings and watches for all Africa, all the Middle East, all of India. That's why we're seeing those 6.1s, those 5.0s, also right there in Iran, India, China, all right, up here, Korea, Japan, all right, folks, Mongolia, Indonesia, Papua New Guinea, um, the Solomon Islands, Australia, New Zealand, warnings and watches till the 15th for moderate to major earthquakes from all this energy look at this energy so all Australia all Indonesia Papua New Guinea Thailand China India the Middle East um, Saudi Arabia Africa uh, Madagascar alright and on top of that when we look at this this is the electron that's within the atmosphere within our atmosphere look where all this energy is right here in the south of uh, the middle of the Pacific Ocean Right here off the Papua New Guinea, up here around Indonesia, Thailand, China, definitely India. Warnings and watches for major activities for the next 24 to 72 hours. Definitely Indonesia and the whole Indian Ocean. Now, when we look at this, the ionosphere map, remember we got a solar windstorm that's hitting Earth as we speak on the 10th and 11th. Alright folks, look at all that energy. It's entering our Earth. It's hitting right here around the Indian Ocean, all the Indian Ocean through India, China, Saudi Arabia, 
uh, the south part of the Middle East, all through Papua New Guinea, uh, all through uh, Indonesia, Thailand, the Solomon Islands out there. So warnings and watches for major storms to the 15th. Warnings and watches for earthquakes and volcanoes in all this region. My links at the bottom. Please be prepared. All right. And when we move on, we're going to go take it to the bottom. We're going to start off with a uh, super volcano activity. April the 7th, 2013, Sanatorian Volcano. April the 10th, today, 2013, Long Valley Cauldron. April the 9th, 2013, the Lashir Volcano in Europe activity. April the 9th, 2013, Camp Flegra. Europe, Italy. When we move up, April the 9th, Yellowstone Cauldron, April the 9th, Island Park Cauldron. Uh, we got two uh, storms in the Indian Ocean. One is not a tropical depression, it's bigger than that. We had volcano activities, two of them yesterday on April the 9th, and Tinelian Island, Vanuatu, and Northern uh, New Zealand. We're about to get into a video on that, it's pretty deep. Let's get to 4.0 and above earthquakes and volcano activities. We had a 4.5 and I ran a 2.6 Spain on a volcano. 4.6 Indian Ocean, 4.2 Iran, 4.3 New Cauldron, the Pacific Ocean, a 2.0 Turkey on a volcano, 4.5 Ecuador, 4.5 Ecuador, 4.9 Iran, 4.9 Iran, 4.8 Indonesia, 4.8 Indonesia, 5.6 Iran. 5.6 Iran, 4.4 Iran, you can see all these volcanoes for Iran, 4.6 Asia, Japan, at Fukushima, 4.6 Japan, Fukushima, warnings and watches for Fukushima, 2.1 Turkey on top of a volcano, 3.5 Taiwan on a volcano, 2.7 North America, Hawaii on a volcano, a 4.3 Iran, 4.3 Iran, 2.5 Hawaii on a volcano, 4.8 just happened in Iran, 4.8 in Iran. All right, folks, I want everyone out there be prepared. We're seeing a lot of strange stuff, man. In the past, look at all this. We got flash floods in Indonesia. We got epidemic hazard in Pakistan. Wild forest fires in China. Wild forest fires in the USA. Hailstorms in Kenya. Snowstorms in U.S. We got tornadoes, all that stuff going on, folks. I want everyone out there be prepared. We got a heat wave in India. We just had a power outages in U.S. state of Virginia, Newport. We're gonna do some other videos later on. Yesterday, um, let's see what we had. We had volcano activities, like I said, New Zealand and Van too. We got lots of stuff going on. All right, so I got warnings and watches right now for moderate to major earthquakes for Alaska. West coast of Canada, all the way to the central Canada, east coast of Canada. Warnings and watches, moderate to major earthquakes, west coast of the United States of America, New Mitch fault line, east coast of the United States of America, all the way up to Iceland, Greenland, Caribbean, all Central America, all South America, the entire Pacific Basin's unrest. Warnings and watches for moderate to severe earthquakes for Central Europe and definitely Spain. Warnings and watches for moderate to major earthquake, the Middle East, India, China, Thailand. Indonesia, Japan, Korea, Australia, New Zealand. I want everyone out there be prepared. We got a big tropical storm out here around Madagascar. We look at harp status. I got warnings and watches for minor to major earthquakes right now for the New Mitch fault line and for severe storms. Like I've been warning people for Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. In the Central Plains, in the Midwest, in the Northeast, in the South. Be prepared. There's no joke. All right, and I got warnings and watches for a harp. Bam. Let's go up around France, England, uh, well, the UK, Ireland, Scotland, Finland, Norland, uh, Norway. All right, folks, I want everyone out there be prepared. Continue to part two for the weather for today. This is the No Face Moon. Please rate, subscribe, comment. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Blogspot, Critterbox, Guy Like Production. Please rate, subscribe for the latest updates. And we got a lot of stuff going on. We're going to get into it. Non-stop videos, non-stop news. This is the movement, movement, movement. Till next time, facing off. Please be prepared. A lot of stuff going down.